to sleep. Oh no! Hey, what are you doing in my house? Oh! Alright guys, now that that hooligan is gone, I can show you how my project works. Come on. So first of all, we have it plugged up into the wall. Now that gives it about 5 to 12 volts. I believe it is six, that's all it needs. And it goes straight into the Arduino. So see this blue wire right here? The blue wire is telling the speaker right here how fast to beep. And where it's getting all its information uh, on how fast to beep is from this photoresistor right here. Now, what the photoresistor does is it takes the light from the surrounding area and puts it into a value. Let's say 30 if it's really low, or 450 if it's really high. So when the laser pointer is pointing right there on the photoresistor, it's really high and does this noise. See, chirp, chirp, chirp. But when you take it off, it starts beeping really fast. Now, if you slowly take away the light off of the photoresistor, it slowly beeps faster and faster. Now, eventually, I don't know why, but it sometimes the value goes into a negative and the circuit just decides, oh, um, that's too fast, and then just decides to kill itself. So, um, all this, this part right here, that little uh, gathering of wires is just the photoresistor. Um, the photoresistor going all the way into the Arduino and telling uh, what the value is. And then this little button right here, it goes, uh, the yellow wires go straight into the reset pin and the ground pin in the Arduino. And uh, whenever that little glitch happens where the value is a negative or zero, I can just press the button and I don't have to open up the box and make this big ruckus trying to get everything uh, back to normal. Um, thank you guys, I hope you like watching and I hope you like my project. I think everyone's asleep. Can you? Damn it. <laughs>